Right, Stu, and time to check back in with uh, Jackie yeah. once again. It's supposed to be fall, but that's going to change a little bit, Jackie? <laughs> yes, that's right, Pat and Rick. Now that's officially fall, it will start to feel more like summer this entire week. Unfortunately, always bad news because of the threat of fires. And in Anaheim right now, we've got a temperature of 79. The reason that the fires started to shift is the winds started to shift out of the west at 11 miles an hour. A humidity at 28%, but again, winds will go up, temperatures will go up, and then the humidity will go down. That's all ingredients for a very dangerous fire weather. Let's take a look at the satellite picture. We, you can see right now that we do have winds coming in out of the northeast and Lancaster. Apple Valley, Highland. Those are very typical Santa Ana winds coming in out of the northeast. We will all start to see uh, northeast winds over the next few days, and that's why we will all be warming up. But the winds have shifted the closer to the coast you go. We're getting a return of the onshore flow as we head into the overnight hours. Hopefully that helps a little bit with humidity levels because inland, take a look at how dry it is from Riverside, Ontario, San Bernardino, Van Nuys, Lancaster into the single digits. Uh, and again, it is going to be extremely hot and dry over the next few days. Now temperatures today did run above average. We had a high today of 88, 82 is the normal high. And look at how warm it is. We're back into the 90s in San Bernardino, upper 80s in Riverside along the coast from Oxnard. We're at 69, warmer at LAX and in Santa Ana into the upper 70s. We do have mostly clear skies. We will actually see plenty of clear skies, but we will be dealing with the heat. Let me show you why. We'll be right in between the surge of high pressure and low pressure. That's a tight pressure gradient. And that's what kicks in the heat with those Santa Ana winds. And the entire week will be hot. Thursday and Friday look like they will be the warmest days of the week. Mostly clear for tonight. The overnight low is right around 63. Let's take a look at your extended forecast. The beaches even into the 80s into next week under sunny skies. But inland and in the valleys, look at that 98 degrees on Friday. So again, Thursday and Friday will be the hottest days of the week from the IE to the high desert and the mountains, just hot and sunny and dry. Back to you guys.